The good news is, when the truth is out, you'll know what you're dealing with. Levi, when did you get home? I didn't hear you come in. He's gone. Uncle Saul is gone. I believe the proper response is, may his memory be for a blessing. One day with Saul and you're super Jewish now? No, but I am super gay. And you telling me that you accept me, yet refusing to tell any member of our family, that's not accepting me. That's not being proud of me, and I can't do it anymore, I won't. I know you loved Uncle Saul and you're upset right now. Uncle Saul is free now, finally free. I'm not going to wait until I'm in an old age home with crocheted blankets, surrounded by people who never got to love me the way I deserved. The bad news is, it might already be too late to do anything about it. Did you put him up to this? No, ma'am. But I agree with every word he said. I love you, Mom. And I thank you for the food and the laundry and I'm moving out. At that point, all you can do is hope you're ready for what comes next. I'll stay at a hotel. No need. My driver's on the way. But please tell me that Maggie turned down your absurd offer. She didn't. In fact, starts Monday. After I got fired, were you hoping I'd fail? I was hoping you'd come to your senses. And now I'm turning Pack North around and it's killing you. It's not killing me. I'm embarrassed for you. It's one thing for you to flush your own career down the toilet. Now you want to drag her down with you, your own child? She's going to put us on the map, and it will have nothing to do with you, and you can't stand that because you need to control everything. But I moved on, and I will do what I want, and I will hire whomever I want, and there isn't a thing in this world you can do to stop me. Yes, Harry, it's me. Sorry to call you so late, but I'd like you to put out some feelers about buying Pack North. <laughs> no, Harry, it's not a joke. Find out their price. I'm sure they have one. You too. Good night. Hope it isn't over. Hope to be saved from pain and loss and despair. This is absurd, and it's not going to work. We'll see. Catherine, what in the hell do you want with my hospital? Well, you said that the place is turning around. It could be a good investment. Or maybe I'll just shut it down. And Richard, I'm not sorry about a damn thing. And most of all, hope that there's something left to say.